Limestone County Schools suspended two employees without pay, but not everyone agrees with the decisions. The superintendent told Way 31 the suspensions involve a school bus driver and an assistant football coach. Way 31 Scotty Kay is in Limestone County tonight with reaction from parents. There's always something going on in the schools. Sometimes it gets blown out of proportion. That was Kathy Nahara's response when she learned Limestone County Schools suspended two employees without pay. In a split vote, the Board of Education suspended Olivia Hardy for swatting at a child. The bus driver said the girl got out of her seat and tried to play under the driver's seat while the bus was moving. If she had even just looked down to see what was on her foot and reared a little bit, she could have went off the road or hit another vehicle. Something other parents agree with. I don't think that that bus driver should have gotten suspended for that because lives were at stake. The district also suspended an assistant football coach whose name has not been released. Superintendent Tom Sisk did tell me the coach threatened to use a racial slur at a player. I think he's trying to be one of the students and he shouldn't. He's a teacher, he's a coach, he's an adult. Some parents say it doesn't matter what the coach was trying to do, the word should never be used, period. It brings back all these bad memories. Um, it's almost pretty much used as a bad word. I don't think it's ever right for a teacher to call a student that word. Now I did speak with Limestone County School Superintendent Tom Sisk and he told me he believes both suspensions were necessary and he says Limestone County Schools will never tolerate even the threat of a racial slur. Reporting in Limestone County, Scotty Kay, Way 31 News. And school officials say the bus driver received a three-day suspension while the assistant coach will be off for a week without pay.